A lot has happened in the last couple of weeks. First of all, I purchased the brand new M1 iPad Pro, and second of all, I created this beautiful design that I shared with you guys on my Instagram. Now, this project is a long way from construction. It's probably at least six months away, but with the help of the brand new M1 iPad, I've been able to bring it to life so much earlier. What's going on guys? My name is David Tomic and welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, firstly, thank you so much for joining me. On this channel, we talk about architecture and technology. That is exactly what we're doing today. I'm combining my two passions to showcase something that I'm really excited to talk to you about today. Augmented reality. Now, for a long time, I've been looking at ways to bring augmented reality into architecture, especially using Archicad as that is my software of choice. I've finally figured it out. Now, I've gone through a long road and tested a lot of different apps, some of them which are complete and utter trash, some of them are pure viruses that crashed my computer and I had to wipe a whole bunch of stuff. But I think I've finally landed on something that is genuine and something that is really, really, really useful for everybody in the field. So today I'm gonna to showcase a number of different things. Firstly, I'm gonna teach you exactly how to export your project from Archicad and import it into the AR app. Second, I'm gonna talk about the AR app, which is Archi, A-R-K-I. It is very simple to use, very easy to download, and there's not really much to it. So today's video is gonna be relatively short, but it's predominantly gonna be me showing my excitement of how good and how useful this can be in today's day life for all architects and architecture students. So let's get started by turning around to these two screens, going over the export process, and then walking you through the archy side of things for the augmented reality. Okay, so this section of the video is gonna be incredibly short because it is very, very simple to export your Archicad model into the FBX file that is required. So what you wanna do is open up the Archicad model that you want to convert to an augmented reality model. Then all you have to do is open it up in 3D, turn on all the layers that you wanna see and delete everything else you don't wanna see. So everything that is seen in this 3D window will be exported directly. Then all we have to do is go File, Save As, and change the name and settings down here. So we wanna scroll down to Twin Motion 2020 FBX. This was my Sketch AAR test file. So we'll click on that again, go save. Yes, I do wanna replace it. And making sure that these settings in front of you right here are exactly the same. So there isn't actually much to change. These are default settings that are already implemented into Archicad and that's absolutely it. Once you're done, you hit OK and let it export. Once it's exported, the second part is relatively simple and relatively easy. All you need to do is upload that file to either OneDrive, Google Drive, or Dropbox. So for example here, I've uploaded mine to Dropbox. It's right here, ska-artest.fbx, and that's it. All I have to do now is go over to my iPad, download the ARKI app or the Archi app, copy and paste this link directly into it, and that's it. Now, before we jump into the Archi side of things, I just wanna let you guys know there's a couple of links down below if you wanna check them out. First of all, there is a Discord chat if you want to join the Discord chat filled with architects and architecture students all around the world. We share our experiences, our ideas, and talk about all these videos in depth. If you join the Patreon Legends level member, you'll get all of my Archicad tutorial files that I create on this channel directly in the Discord chat available for download as soon as my videos go live. There's also some great merch down below in the description as well for all architects and future architects. So if you know somebody that wants to be a future architect or somebody that is an architect themselves, be sure to check out the link below. Anyway, Enough of my rambling, let's get it started with this augmented reality side of the video. So what we wanna do is come across, go into our app store, find Archi right here on the right hand side. It's by Darf Design LTD or Experience Architecture in AR. As you can see, it shows you exactly what it does and it genuinely does do that. Now it does have some paid features inside of the app which I think are a bit 
over the top, especially for this tutorial, but we're not gonna showcase any of that. We're just gonna to stick to the free features. Now, let's go into the Archie folder. It'll start here in this gallery and it's all their basic projects that they have available for you to just play with. If you wanna import your own file that we've just exported from Archicad, we're gonna to go to the plus sign. It's gonna successfully load this basic project in there. Now, what we do is come out of that. Let's go to our Dropbox again. We're gonna go copy link, copy link, and move back to Archie. Now, we wanna tap this import button down here, which if I use the mouse on the iPad, close that, it is this one on the left-hand side. Then all we have to do is come into the paste link and paste our link directly in there. Now, all we have to do is click import, preparing for it to download, give it a few seconds depending how big the file is, and there it is. It is imported in 3D into our software. Now, obviously, this is all well and good that it's a nice 3D model and you can play with it and you know fumble around and figure out what's going on, but we want it in AR, that's what it's all about. So, let's pop it off that keyboard, press this magic blue square up the top, move our iPad around, and there it is. It is perfectly placed in front of us as a 3D model. So now if I come closer to you guys and share this project in full augmented reality, we can start moving around it, we can start checking out what's going on, how the roof works, how the boundary is, how far it's cut into the ground, what the garage looks like, what the stairs look like, where the bin storage is. It is absolutely incredible what we can do on the iPad so quickly and so easily. And that's basically it. There's nothing really more to this video. It is a very, very simple tutorial, but extremely, extremely effective. There is a million and one different features in the premium version of Arky, but I haven't paid for it, I haven't tested it out, I haven't been sponsored by the company. It's just genuinely me showing my love and appreciation for architecture and technology as it progresses right now in 2021. Anyway, that's all for me today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you could genuinely share my excitement about this new technology and how much it's advanced and how much it's progressed in such a short period of time. It has made it so accessible to the masses and I'm truly, truly grateful that I've stumbled upon something so unique. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you smash that subscribe button down below and don't forget about the like button. Somehow and truly it does help with the YouTube algorithm. It helps more people see these videos and it helps this channel grow. So every one of you that smashed that like button, thank you so much. It truly is appreciated. But like I said, that's all for me today. So I'll see you next Monday.